In this session, we're going to learn how to insert charts in PowerPoint 2016, how to utilize charts and customize charts in PowerPoint 2016. So supposedly we have a presentation very similar to this and we have a new slide here and we want to insert charts. To insert charts, you'd simply go under insert here. So you'd stay on the slide that you want to insert the chart. Then under insert, click on chart. And then you pick uh, first pick the type of chart that you would prefer to insert into your presentation and then click OK. Now the next thing here is, is that it will actually open a worksheet very similar from Excel and notice it gives you some data here already. So you could have, for example, the monthly sales or whatever it may be, uh, the data that you are utilizing. And in our case here, let's assume that these are the quarters. So for example, we have quarter one, quarter two, quarter three sales. And then we have the categories here, tablets, desktops, mobile phones and such. And these, let's say they are into millions or whatever the case might be. Then you would basically update the, this data from here. So let's say that was 4.5 million or whatever it may be the case. Just change those numbers and notice it gives you a preview of what the data is going to look like. Now notice that there is a blue line here in the bottom. This is what controls what shows up on your chart. So you can simply drag this to the left and now notice our chart. It's going to look differently automatically here. If we drag it to include let's say desktops as well then it will readjust automatically. So just keep in mind that this dot here in the bottom right, if you hold the mouse on it, you can adjust the data from there. Now, once you have the data there, now once you have the data entered and customized or picked up here, so we go back, then we close the data here, and now we have our chart. Now, if we click on our chart, notice that we have two tabs here on the top. You have the design tab and the formatting tab. The formatting, of course, you can see the options here and the formatting the content of the components here. The next one is to change the uh, design for this chart. Now, notice that you have different layouts that you can apply here, like uh, include the title, the legend and such, and the placement of the legend and such and the chart. So I'll suggest you play with these options here. The next thing is that you can change the colors again, just like with other objects that we have covered earlier, you can apply and change the colors and such and the design and so on. So you'd pick the design that works best for your presentation here. And note also that you can actually click on any of those objects. So let's say you don't like this specific color, the font or whatever it may be. You can go here under the format tab and then change the to fill this with a different color that you might prefer. If you wanted to select different data to go back to your data selection, notice your option is right here under select data. And then if you wanted to change the chart type, you would simply click on change chart type here and then pick something different that might work best for you. That's how, in a nutshell, how you can utilize charts in PowerPoint 2016.